Are the New York Giants on the brink of a major shakeup? With the trade deadline fast approaching, rumors are swirling about potential moves that could reshape the team. As the Giants struggle with a disappointing 2-5 start, could they be parting ways with key defensive players to bolster their offense? Stay tuned as we dive into the latest buzz surrounding the Giants and explore what this could mean for the team moving forward. If you want to stay in the loop on all things Giants, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give us a like. As we dive into the latest moves from the New York Giants, it's hard not to feel a mix of hope and frustration. After a rocky start to the season, with a 2-5 record, the Giants find themselves in a position where they might need to pivot before the NFL trade deadline. The glaring issues on offense have put significant pressure on quarterback Daniel Jones, and it's clear that something needs to change. One of the most intriguing options on the table is trading Aziz Ojulari. After three productive years, his value has skyrocketed, especially following his recent performance with three sacks in just two games. With Kayvon Thibodeau expected to return soon, Ojulari's time as a starter could be limited, making this the perfect moment for the Giants to capitalize on his value. Teams like the Detroit Lions are looking for help on the edge, and Ojulari could be a prime target. I can't help but wonder, is this the right move? Trading him could bring in valuable offensive assets that the team desperately needs. Then we have Adoree Jackson. At 29 years old and coming off a one-year contract extension, he represents another potential trade piece. Sure, he has experience, but his best days seem behind him, and with injuries plaguing him, his performance has dipped. However, there are contenders out there who might overlook his recent struggles for a veteran presence on their roster. Should the Giants pull the trigger on a deal if the right offer comes along? Personally, I feel torn. Jackson still offers something to the team, especially with the uncertainty in the secondary. These decisions are crucial, not just for this season, but for the future of the franchise. With so many holes in the roster, the Giants need to be smart about how they navigate this trade deadline. And let's be honest, the pressure on Brian DeBall is palpable. Many are questioning his future. And while his relationship with GM Joe Schoen seems solid, you have to wonder how much longer that can last if results don't improve. So, what do you think? Should the Giants trade Ojulari and Jackson to build for the future, or hold on and hope for a turnaround? I really want to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on all things Giants. And make sure to hit that notification bell so you never miss a moment.